Hello colors, welcome to Viva Barca and welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some interesting transfer updates. We start with Neymar Jr. as it has been reported that the former Barcelona winger is not in manager Xavi's plans despite wanting a Barca return. We are going to be discussing on that as we progress. Secondly, talking about Bruno Guimaraes of Newcastle United. As it has been reported that Newcastle have offered 30 million euro plus 60 million euro for Rafinha, according to Barca based journalist Gerard Romero. We are also going to be discussing on that. So, guys, as we get right into it, please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe so you always stay up to date. Don't forget to turn on the post bell notification so you always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch the video right up to the very end barcelona were ultimately met with disappointment in their pursuit of Lionel messi this summer as the forward opted to join inter miami ahead of a return to catalonia barca though were recently handed the opportunity to secure the return of another former superstar in neymar recent reports have suggested the brazilian international is determined to return to his old stomping grounds and is even willing to lower his salary. However, according to Javi Miguel of AS, Barcelona have no intention to bring back the former Santos whiskey. It appears the player is not included in Javi's plans for next season, even though he was once teammates with the current Barcelona head coach. The manager had already confirmed as much in an interview earlier this month when he said, In theory, he is not in our sports planning. I appreciate him enormously as a person, but he is not a priority. Xavi and Neymar played together at Barcelona from 2013 to 2015 before Xavi eventually joined our side, but the Barca coach is not too keen on bringing Neymar back to Camp Nou. And that could be due to multiple factors. For one, Neymar is 31. At 31, he has left the best years of his career behind. Even though his performances at PSG have still been relatively impressive, the forward has struggled too much with injuries to be considered a viable option for Barcelona. The PSG superstar also commands a hefty salary, which could be a burden on Barcelona even if it gets lowered. Not to mention, the forward probably will not fit into the side tactically, given that Javi is looking for a more long-term alternative for Robert Lewandowski. To that end, Barcelona have made some ground in their bid to sign Vitor Roche. They are expected to hold talks with Atletico Paranense to clear the final details to seal that deal. So as things stand, two new midfielders are the top priority for Barca, along with Vitor Roche. Once those positions are addressed, they would potentially look for a new right back. So Neymar, as things stand, is a luxury signing that the La Liga champions can do without. Of course, this is not surprising at all that Javi does not consider Neymar a priority. This is not the first time we have been talking about Neymar showing interest to Barca. Of course, this comes after... PSG have told him that he should look for a new club because they don't count on him any longer. And of course, we know the PSG fans have been frustrated with Neymar about his injuries and of course, lack of consistency and so on and so forth. And honestly, as I've always said, I have no issue with Neymar coming back. If Barca are open to it, it will be good. Because honestly, we need, we need productive wingers. You know, last season we saw how our wingers were not were out of form, the likes of Ferran Torres, the likes of Ansu Fati. And of course, I think Neymar coming back, despite the age of 31, he feel he's far better than those two. And I think coming back would be a great addition to the squad. But Javi sees his own thing his own way. So he's a manager, he has a say, and everything he says, then the club will respect it because he's the one responsible for the team. You know, I think Neymar looking for, Bas looking for a new club, definitely. He wants to leave PSG himself. He have been there for almost six years and of course it will be time for him to call end to his career there um, of course Neymar still has a lot to play to be honest despite injury woes in his career especially at PSG 
Neymar wants to look for a new club as soon as possible. He has been linked to the Premier League. The likes of Manchester United have been showing interest and so on and so forth. But Barcelona is a club that Neymar still has in his heart. There's no, there's all indication that Neymar still loves Barca and he has told the club that he wants to return and he's willing to reduce his salary significantly because the whole world knows what Barca is going through, right? As to when, as to concerns the financial fair play, Neymar is willing to cut his salary to join his former club. And of course, it's, it's going to be very complicated after what Javi said the other time that he understands what Neymar wants, but the truth is, he is not a priority for him right now. You know, Javi has other priorities, as he said, he wants a new pivot, he wants an interior midfielder, a backup striker, and after that, from there, they can go for other necessities like a new right back, a new left winger, and possibly a backup left winger. So let's see how it goes. But honestly, it looks very difficult at this point, despite Neymar showing interest to return and willing to cut his salary to help the club. But it would, it would be difficult as manager Javid does not see him as a priority. Then moving on to the next story of discussion. According to a latest update from Gerard Romero, Newcastle United have acted on their interest in Barca winger Rafinha by tabling an offer. As per the report, the Premier League club, who will be playing in the UEFA Champions League next season, have sent in an offer worth €30 million Euro plus midfield mainstay Bruno Guimaraes in exchange for the Brazilian international. Rafinha joined Barca only last summer, arriving from Leeds United in a deal worth €65 million, Euros, including add-ons. After, after a slow start to his life in Catalonia, Rafinha grew in stature with time and finished the season as a crucial player for the La Liga champions. However, given Barca's need to sell players, Rafinha has been constantly linked with a summer exit, despite reports suggesting that Barcelona do not intend to sell him. Reports have, su have suggested now that an offer close to 70 million euro or more could convince Barca to part ways with the attacker. Newcastle United, for one, have shown the strongest interest in Rafinha and now have made an offer for him. As per the new report, the Magpies are putting 30 million euros in cash on the table, along with midfielder Bruno Guimaraes, whose market value is currently at 60 million euros. Guimaraes is a player that has been on the radar for Barca as a possible replacement for Busquets. However, his tip valuation meant that his signing was never really considered seriously at the Camp Nou. Given how important the Brazilian midfielder is for Newcastle United, it does seem strange that they would be willing to sacrifice him in order to get their hands off Rafinha. If there is such an offer on the table, it could appeal to Barca. However, it is hard to imagine that the Premier League club have offered up one of their best and most important players as part of the deal for Barca attacker Rafinha. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye for now.